Our leading story tonight was supposed to have been a report on the peace talks in Ireland, but our network has just been informed of a highly significant development in relation to District Inspector Potter. It appears that an anonymous letter has been received by Mrs Lily Potter in care. Let's go to our security correspondent now for more details. Since early this afternoon, anxious reports have circulated the town of Clare about an unconfirmed report of District Inspector Potter's death. I am now in a position to confirm the contents of an anonymous letter that was given to Mrs Lily Potter. It states that D.I. Gilbert Potter, having been duly tried and convicted, was sentenced to death, which sentence was duly carried out on the 27th of April. Signed, O-C. The letter added that, during the time of custody, the officer was well treated and shown every consideration. Kevin Farrell, reporting for CSHSN News. CSHSN has just spoken to Mary, who works in the Potter household. One of the letters that Mrs Potter received this morning was addressed to her in Irish. As soon as she opened it, I could see her becoming increasingly upset, saying, Gilbert's gone. Gilbert's gone. I sent for the doctor straight away, and he said she should stay in bed for the next couple of days. And he said that the letter was written by a prankster, and that Mrs Potter should continue to pray for Gilbert's safe return home. Thank you. CSHSN has obtained a copy of the letter received by Mrs Lily Potter. It is the first written intimation that Gilbert Potter has been killed by the Irish Republican Army.